Welcome to Snapcoms. This training session covers the content template feature. A content template provides the ability to save and reuse commonly used messages. It is the replacement for the Snapcoms quick publish feature. Content templates are available for all the new Snapcoms tools using the designer interface. In this session, I will use this example of an alert from the HR department welcoming a new staff member. An alert like this is used each time somebody joins the company. So it makes sense to save it as a content template, then simply edit out the employee details each time it's used. The HR team has set up this alert exactly how they want it, with their department theme, the layout with a picture on the left and text on the right, as well as a footer with a sign off from the team. It is also set up to be sent to the whole organization immediately for a week and delivered to Snapcom's apps on PCs and mobiles. The pop-up notification will stay on screen for 10 seconds and recur every hour until it is read. Switching the view, we can see that the pop-up notification has also been beautifully laid out. Now let me show you how easy it is to convert this to a content template for efficient reuse by the HR team. Open the alert from the folder you have saved it in. Open the Actions menu and save it as a content template. Give the content template a descriptive name. I will call it New Staff Announcement Template and save it to your HR folder. The grey shading in the background indicates that this is now a content template that we are looking at. It's as simple as that. Returning to the HR folder where I saved the content template, you can see it in the list with the wizard icon which indicates that it is a content template. Let's imagine that a few weeks have passed and a new staff member is joining today. I'll show you how the HR team can use the content template to quickly send out a new alert. Select Create Content and look for the content template in the list or search for it by name. Notice that it is identified by the blue content template label. Let's select the new staff announcement template. Notice the preview on the right of the content template that we are using. Give the new alert a name and save it in the HR folder. Now the content template opens for editing. Simply change out the name, picture, title, and description in the content window, as well as the notification window. Remember all the other settings are preset based on the content template. This new alert welcoming Anthony is ready to publish and the original content template remains available for reuse as many times as required. A final note, the new staff announcement template can be edited if required. Perhaps the HR team want to change something in the footer area. Simply return to the content template from the HR folder, update the details. All changes are auto-saved and will be reflected next time the content template is used. Thank you for watching this training session. If you require any more help, please email tech.support at snapcoms.com.